Have you ever had a trade get stopped out early, only to then have the market turn and move in the direction you originally predicted? We all have, and it's frustrating. Let's look at how you can use Nadex call spreads to provide time for your prediction to potentially hold true without worrying about getting stopped out. There are three key benefits to trading Nadex call spreads. One, Simplified trade setups that allow you to focus on predicting a range without having to manually build a more complicated setup. Two, a variety of expirations, so you can choose the time range that suits your trade. And three, clearly defined risk before you enter a trade, so there are no margin calls or surprises. Let's walk through how to trade index call spreads using less capital, allowing you to access the markets without worrying about margin calls. Nadex lists call spreads for three market classes, stock indices, forex, and commodities. Within each market class, you'll see the various products available. Within each product, you'll see the current indicative price of that market and the call spread ranges available. With predefined ranges, Nadex enables you to focus on your trading opportunity and the markets instead of having to build a call spread from scratch each time allowing you the option to quickly and easily enter a trade. There are several call spread contracts available for each market, and there can be a variety of expirations. As an example, let's click on a daily call spread under US 500. This populates a chart showing the price of the Nadex Indicative Index for the US 500, and also brings up an order ticket on the right-hand side of the platform displaying the specifics for this Nadex call spread, which include the range of the contract, the current indicative price, and when the contract expires. Nadex call spreads have a set range with the lower price called the floor and the higher price called the ceiling, indicated by the shaded area on the chart. With a predefined range, you know your maximum potential profit or loss up front, so you can choose the range that best suits your risk reward profile. If you predict the price of the S&P 500 index will rise, you'd buy a price level to initiate the trade, and the call spread on the chart will be shaded blue. With call spreads, you have optionality included. So if either the ceiling or floor is touched, you're still in the trade and you have time for your trade to potentially be right. As such, if you predict the S&P 500 were going higher, you may consider choosing a call spread that is trading near the floor of a contract to minimize your risk exposure to the downside while trying to maximize your potential gains to the upside. However, if you predict the price of the S&P 500 index will decline, you'd sell a price level to initiate the trade, and the call spread on the chart will be shaded red. In this case, you may consider choosing a call spread that is trading near the ceiling of a contract to minimize your risk exposure to the upside, while trying to maximize your potential gains to the downside. Remember, when selling a call spread, even if the ceiling is touched, you're still in the trade and you have time for the S&P 500 market to potentially decline to support your original prediction. The prices of call spreads will constantly fluctuate as the price of the underlying market changes. In fact, the price levels you trade for call spreads will generally track the underlying, except there will be some premium baked into the price of a call spread due to the optionality at the floor and ceiling. As with other options, time to expiration and volatility will impact the amount of that premium. Essentially, when trading call spreads, you predict whether the price is going to rise or decline, and you have predetermined levels to create defined risk-reward characteristics before you enter a trade. On Nadex charts, you can quickly and easily identify which call spread range best suits your trading style and you can switch between different call spreads by clicking on the ranges on the right-hand side of the chart. At the bottom of the order ticket, your potential maximum profit or loss is clearly calculated before you enter a trade, whether you're buying, going long, or selling, going short. With Nadex call spreads, the amount of capital you need to put up for a trade is the maximum risk when you initiate the position. Once you've initiated a trade, your capital requirements do not change. At Nadex, there's no such thing as margin calls. With predefined risk, you can't lose any more than you initially put into a trade. An important note when trading call spreads, you can exit a trade early. 
Just because there's an expiration associated with the contract does not mean you have to wait until expiration to see what happens. You can choose to close a position early if you'd like to lock in profits or limit losses. To close a long position, you'd simply sell it at the current market price. To close a short position, you'd simply buy it back at the current market price. To quickly exit a position, click on it in the positions window at the bottom of the platform to bring up an order ticket pre-populated with the opposite side of the trade. Or, if you prefer, click the close button next to the position to open an order ticket to submit a market order to close the position. If you haven't exited the position early, the contract will settle at the applicable settlement price at expiration. The profit or loss in your trade will be the difference between the price level you bought or sold and the settlement price, excluding any exchange fees. And there you have it. You can now leverage Nadex call spreads to trade the price of indices, Forex, and commodities markets, whether you predict they're going up or down.